Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how exactly you can use the end screen template in the split screen of Filmora 11.7.6. And you know that I create a YouTube channel and I put the end screen inside my video and there's a mistake. So I decided to make this tutorial just to show you the mistakes so that you will not make the same mistake as me. And if you want to upgrade to this latest version, I will put the link in the description for you. Just download it and then you can install it on your computer and you get the latest one. Okay. All right. So this is my example timeline. And actually, this is um, a vlog for my Vietnamese channel. And you can see here, I use the end screen, the new one of Filmora 11.7. And this is the one that I use. So did you see the mistake inside here? Okay, so when I put the end screen here on the timeline, there is still an image here, here, and here. So that is a mistake because it will be on our YouTube video. Okay, it's terrible. Okay, so to get rid of this thing, it is very simple. Okay, so uh, let's delete this one. So for example, if you want to use the split screen or the end screen template in the split screen, you want to select the split screen here and then go to the end screen and now you want to select one of these 10 templates for your video. For example, I'm going to use this one. Just put it here on the timeline. Okay, and I will mute the audio also. And this is the, the split screen. And the first thing, you want to replace this position with a sample color. You can select black or white. So just go back to your media and then you want to select sample color here. So for my case, I will select black. So just drag and drop it to this position. It will replace the image inside. And you can do the same for the subscribe button. And also the next video. Okay, and this is the first issue. And the second issue is that the template here is only five seconds. So we have to make it 20 seconds or 25 seconds, right? And we can duplicate it. But first thing first, we can press shift and to bring the playhead to the end of the split screen. And now we can press Ctrl D to duplicate it. Okay, one time, two time, three time, so that I make a 20 second split screen, okay? But it copied to here, so I can just move it down here. So this is 20 second end screen. And if you want to make 25 second or stuff like that, you can just duplicate it. And now we have a, an end screen here. Alright, so that is how you can use the end screen template in the split screen of Fibra 11.7.6. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know in the comment section below. And thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.